a very popular form of the expansion of x plus y whole to the power n occurs when x is replaced by 1 and y is replaced by x. We get 1 plus x whole to the power n equals nc0 plus nc1x plus nc2x square until ncn x to power n. In this expression, the coefficient of x to the power r is ncr and the general term is given as tr plus 1 equals ncr x to the power r. Let us mark this as equation 1. Now, if I replace x with minus x in equation 1, I would get 1 minus x whole to the power n equals nc0 minus nc1x plus nc2x square minus nc3x cube and so on with alternate positive and negative signs. Let us mark this equation as equation number 2. Now, if I were to add 1 and 2 and divide that with 2, I would get the left hand side would be 1 plus x whole to the power n plus 1 minus x whole to the power n divided by 2 and on the right hand side I would be able to cancel out the terms containing odd binomial coefficients say nc1x or nc3x square and so on and I would be left with nc0 plus nc2x square plus nc4x to the power 4 and so on. Now if I put x equals to 1 I get a very very interesting result. It would be 2 to the power n plus 0 divided by 2 equals nc0 plus nc2 plus nc4 and so on. This means that the sum of the even binomial coefficients equals 2 to the power n minus 1. This is a very important technique and we will be using similar techniques to find out different types of sums of the binomial coefficients in this chapter. If this is very clear to you, you should be able to answer the next quiz. What will be the sum of the odd binomial coefficients that is nc1 plus nc3 plus nc5 and so on. Your options are the following. 